my chair back. We have a number of things to talk about today. I have some things that I'm going to start with, and then I know you guys will have a number of questions. But first, you know, there was, enough, there was a great deal of discussion today about the uh, Cavantes Orchestra and our sister city relationship and uh, the ceremonies around the, the, the fall of the Berlin Wall, which is a, kind of a nice segue into what I'm going to talk about right now, which is our sixth annual Citizenship Month. Citizenship Month actually started uh, six years ago as Citizenship Week but it has expanded, and it, it really is based around the fact that Houston is an amazingly diverse and international city, and that citizenship is so much more than just the country on your passport, or the country to which you may swear an allegiance. Citizenship is also about contributing to the broader community, contributing what you can as a citizen of an area, as a good neighbor, as someone who is actively engaged in civic life. And because Houston is such an amazingly diverse international city, when we bring our international communities together, highlight those international communities, it raises their awareness of each other, but it brings attention to a lot of hidden treasures across the community. And that is really why Citizenship Week has so quickly become Citizenship Month, jam-packed with great activities highlighting the various cultures and communities of Houston. Citizenship Month falls within the operations of the Department of Neighborhoods. And within the Department of Neighborhoods, the Office of International Communities. But it is an entirely volunteer-driven initiative. It, the uh, Office of International Communities does some internal coordination. But this is a, uh, an outpouring of interest from the community that keeps it going. We encourage civic engagement, commemorate the spirit of good citizenship through a wide range of events from community groups, educational groups, civic organizations, all underwritten by corporate sponsors. The Citizenship Month Committee's honorary chair is uh, my wife and the Houston First Lady, Kathy Hubbard. She took this responsibility over from uh, Andrea White, who first initiated Citizenship Month. It currently encompasses more than 300 different events. So obviously she and I cannot attend most of those events. But uh, I know Kathy is a hands-on chair. I know it says honorary, but she's very interested in what happens with the committee and the number of activities that are highlighted. Also joining me are two of our most uh, generous supporters and consistent supporters. And those are Dr. Bill Flores, president of the University of Houston downtown, and Dr. Noel Vizette Flores, executive director of UHD's Center for Public Service and Family Strengths. I want to introduce Dr. Flores uh, to say uh, a few words about Citizenship Month, why he's involved, and uh, how University of Houston downtown fits into this overall scheme. 